hard. So nobody's gonna let you do that. You're gonna get your full grip. You're gonna pull hard. Natural reaction is for him to try to bring his elbow and wrist back down. That is when I'm gonna get my whole body behind this. I'm gonna close my elbows to my ribs. I'm gonna drop my weight and I'm gonna bulldoze this arm down to the mat. We're gonna pin this wrist to the mat and we're not gonna let it off the mat until the person taps. My elbow's close to the ear. I've got a cup grip on the wrist now. Now if at any point in time, early or late in this submission, if I'm attacking the arm on this side and I feel the leg on that side come off the mat, I'm gonna shoot a grapevine hook through, I'm gonna stretch it, I'm gonna drop my hip down. Now from this position I tap the mat so the blade of my thumb can slide under the elbow and I'm gonna grip my own wrist. But once I grab my wrist, we have this reoccurring theme with figure four grips. Torque your motorcycle grip. So knuckles roll forward, wrists roll up into a hilt, it tightens down the lock. I'm gonna paint brush his hand down and then as I'm paintbrushing it down below his ear line, I'm gonna raise his elbow off the mat and I get my tap.